right guys i'm going to be testing fallout 84 this is on the samsung galaxy z fold 5 and i'm using the dual sense controller it's a ps5 gamepad and this is solely to find out if this game is going to allow me it says it needs the size of the patch is 687.66 megabytes make sure there's enough space on your device and that you are connected to wi-fi before updating yes i'm connected to wi-fi it says file 84 uh, version 2.3.0.0 update announcement what what's happening with this thing is it still on the update thing i don't get this thing wait wait same hey, hey survivors file 84 is scheduled to update at utc 240530 um i think this is midnight 000 that's midnight that's 12 a.m uh the downtown will be approximately uh three hours we apologize for the inconvenience but the bright the on the bright side you'll be compensated with gold x4000 uh and then it says after the new version is released survivors can go to the store to update the game um update features added new tactical skills to uh for ember and lucinda uh it says adjusted hero balance third adjusted weapon balance fourth added three new tunnels in sunder realms for uh five introduced a new bandage item six reset season rank information for default season right so it's downloading something in the background but i don't know what this means i'm going to allow it to finish the download because uh i'm hoping that if it downloads this thing it will let me uh play the game it's saying at midnight so why is that gonna affect me now i, I i'm just gonna let the download in the background do its thing and hope that it's just gonna start the game i just want to test the jolson's controller i like this game I play this on uh, iPhone with the backbone. Works perfectly. Like I said, everything works. Just start the game. Oh, come on. Oh, it's working. Oh. <laughs> it's working. Oh, cool. Uh, so I'm going to test the DualSense controller. I just want to see if this is working with the game. So what's this thing about midnight? I thought that happened yesterday. Oh, they said on the 20th, isn't it? But we're not on the 20th. The 20th is long gone. Right. So let's start the game. It says loading. It says, uh, how much do you know about Firelight? I'll just say I'm a pro. I played this before. Yes. I don't even know why it's asking me all these things. I played this game before. Uh, it says to tap the button to start the battle. Right. So let's. Oh, sorry about that. Let, let's see. I moved the tripod. Right. So let's see. I wonder if it's going to recognize the... Oh, okay. I, I remember now. I, I get it now. Oh, what the hell? Oh, wait, wait. I want, I want this kid. This is the best choice for humans. Oh, it's asking about... Um, it's asking about the the touch controls. I hope this is not going to be a problem. I don't want your life to go to waste. Join my collection and you'll gain eternity. I hope this works. <laughs> I hope this works with you said. Because it was saying something about um it's saying something about the touch controls. I don't want to use touch controls. Let's let's just see. Let's see, is this, uh, let's see, is this gonna work? No. Oh, wait, wait, it works. What? It works. <laughs> it's working. Check, check this out. Look, it's working. I can't believe this thing. It's working with the DualSense controller. Okay, so how do I jump? Right, so I, I pressed um, the, the X. It's working with the DualSense controller. Oh my this is so cool um okay where did those guys go they've gone back in no this is cool because i didn't know this was possible um i i know this works with um oh wow i can't even sprint 
like I'm double tapping. At least it's on auto firing, so I don't have to bother myself with that. There are materials here. Okay, so I didn't manage to get another gun. Oh wow, it's it's. I don't have a second weapon, do I? How about this thing? Oh yeah, so how do I collect? No, 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 I need this thing. Ah, damn. Shield storage, so... Okay. Oh, wait, wait. I don't know what, what I did there. It's not, it's, it's like, it's not responding to clicking. You know, like the clicking uh, part, like running. Oh, wow, this... Oh, so, okay, so you've got to press um the the upper triggers what the hell just happened oh wow okay so what is this i've got a second weapon can i swap weapons uh how do i swap weapons okay you can jump you can jump uh i'm clicking inwards no the clicking in doesn't work so you need to press on your shield uh the swapping of weapons doesn't work can't swap weapons, uh, but you can shoot, right? Okay, I, I don't want the shotgun. Uh, so, you, you're gonna be kind of stuck with, um, right, so the things that work are jumping. Right, so the, the jumping works. Where's, the, where's this do that? So, you can't Basically, you, you cannot, uh, the things I'm noticing, uh, the most about the game is, okay, okay, so you can't jump. All right, so is he running then? What happened? He's got no weapons on him. Right, so if he's got no weapons on him, it seems like he moves slightly slower. slower. I can't actually, okay, so this is on auto-targeting. I mean, auto-firing, sorry. There, there is some sort of control. Oh, nice one. Right, the good thing is you auto-pick stuff up. Uh, but the, the negative on this is that it's not recognizing, like, sprinting. Like, if you press down on the left thumbstick, it's not recognizing that. But if you got auto firing on, then you don't have to worry about it. it you can fire your weapon by <laughs> pressing. Oh, check this out! I swapped the gun. All oh, right. If you press the square, the square is to swap the weapon. Check. Look. Uh, what what happened? I don't know what happened. It's not swapping it now, but uh, it was. You see? Yeah, I swapped it. You see? You need to press the square button. Right. So let me see. Wait. Oh, so you can put point. your weapons back. So if you, okay, if you press down on the, the square button, you will put both weapons on his back. I'm trying to get onto, oh, right. If you press X, you, you will be able to, if you press X, you'll be able to get onto the zip lines. So that's what X allows you to do. Uh, you can get onto the zip lines and, um, So what happens? I'm trying to see, like, how do you collect stuff if you want to collect something? Right, so you can use the zip line. You see? Just by pressing X, you can use the zip line. Right. Um, I think it's a good thing to have uh, the auto firing on. Uh, just, you know, just in case. But, uh, like I said, um, this game does work. Oh, wait, this guy's behind there. It's a pity that I can't actually zone in. But the one thing I'm wondering is, is it possible to use those abilities like uh, jumping and stuff? Because the, the problem that I'm facing is... The problem that I'm facing is... I'm not really getting like... Um, but you see, he is auto-picking stuff up. Right. So one, I can't actually sprint, uh, but you can use zip lines. Restoring you can jump. Shield. Jumping is fine. Oh, oh, wait. Okay, you can. 
Okay, you can scope in. But you know what's happening? It's mostly the top triggers, right? So if you scope in, you can shoot. Oh, wait. Okay, swapping weapons. Oh, check this out. Oh, wait. How do you get rid of that thing? <laughs> I just said, okay, okay, wait. I just want to see something. So what happens if you click on something? Nothing happens. Oh, it's a shield, right? It, it gives you a description. I just think Restore UMP S SMG Relax. item. Okay, so this is more like, um, oh, so you have to press, okay, so you can open and close that. Right, let me, let me close this. I don't want people to hear me like uh, I'm an amateur. Well, I am kind of because I've never played this on Android. I play this on the iPhone and I do use the backbone, which works perfectly. But yeah, if you double click, you see nothing happens. Uh, if you press the top trigger and and O or whatever, you see. What? Well, he is running. Okay, so he, he does kind of run. Reloading. It's a slow run, but he will run if he's not uh, holding any of his weapons. Right, so where, where have these guys gone? Gone Reloading. in there. Don't worry. So I'm thinking if you want to use your abilities, you're going to need to realistically um press Don't worry. I'll help you fix up that scar. okay you're gonna need to realistically um press on the screen but remember like i said i, I do have that app Reloading. that Reloading. allows me to add uh, games and controllers <laughs> uh, games and controllers <laughs> games and controllers um onto the the phone itself but um like i said it's it does require a payment and um that that app itself it's free to download but to use it you need to pay for it i don't know how else to describe describe the whole uh process you do need you will need um to all right so it wants me to update my shields Right, someone's aiming at me. I've got auto firing on me. Oh, please. Yes. I'm the Reaper. Wow. You know, people actually think I'm good at the game. Um, so basically, uh, what that app allows you to do is that it will allow you to add apps, uh, sorry, games, and uh, different types of um, game pads onto the app itself uh let's see what what do you do in this thing oh wow got xp 160 xp for that thing all right so this is automatically doing stuff for me i don't have to like um force anything oh wow wow, wow. oh damn 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 how do i oh wow um right so if you want to kind of slow run like what he is doing Unfortunately, you 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 need to use, uh, you need to pack in all of your uh, gun stuff. I think these dudes are probably wondering why I'm so slow. Oh come on! Right, I, I couldn't I couldn't wait for it any longer, because if 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 I keep waiting, this dude's gonna die. Uh, it's not too bad. I think I can still make it. I had to tap the screen because otherwise this guy is not Reloading. going to do anything. Ah, you know, it's going to take too long. See? Um, okay. Besides the app itself, um, the game is working with the gamepad. Kind of. If you uh, press down on the square button on your DualSense. I'm using a DualSense controller. I think that button on uh, the Xbox would be A. I'm trying to think A, B, X, Y. Yeah. I can't drive. It won't let me get into the car. I'm pressing other buttons. I want to see what button it will allow me to get in. Right. So it seems like if you want to heal, at the moment you need to press healing. Uh, let, me, let me get into this. Oh, pity. Do I not have anything? Right. Uh, need to jump into this. Can I drive? Oh, I can drive. How, how come I'm not driving? 
Oh, I'm wow. I'm not looking for these things. <laughs> look, look at this. It it will drive backwards. Oh, okay, okay, no, I get it now. Uh, it's the top triggers. I need it because definitely I'm moving too slow, man. <laughs> it's the top triggers. So on, on your DualSense controller, it's going to be the top triggers, the, the smaller buttons. Those are the buttons I'm using. So if you're wondering how I'm driving with the DualSense, then that's how I'm doing it. Oh, did I get that person? All right, let me see. Transform. Can I annihilate this person? Come on. Ah, oh, damn it, man. Oh, wow. Okay, okay, I was driving backwards. Someone come and kill this dude for me. Oh, wow. Just, just shooting me, man. Um, so it's possible to drive with the dual sense. You need to tap on the buttons on the top. Oh, wow. What's this dude doing? <laughs> Say directed. But I'm hitting him. Oh, he's going to kill me now. Where's everyone going to? Right. It's not letting me heal, though. Right, okay, then my team has arrived. I'm just doing the best I can with, with what this game is allowing me to do, you understand? So, I'm, I'm trying to give you guys my uh, honest opinion. It seems like it does kind of work. So, it looks like I'll have to keep doing this until, <laughs> until he dies. He's dead. <laughs> He's dead. He's dead. He's, 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 Oh wow! Check this out. Right, so if you want to run with the with the game, you can run. But I'm finding like, how come I can't heal? Oh wow! Come on, come on! Oh, they fell down. What? What's happening? Oh wow! Come on. Okay, just chill. Don't move. Time. All right, I'm healing this dude up. I'm just showing you that I'm actually using the the dual sense controller. I don't want you guys to think that I'm making this stuff up. Um, but I feel like okay. So how do I heal? Oh, you gotta select what you wanna use for healing. Okay. If this was a dual sense controller, I wouldn't have all these issues. So that's that's the shield. So what is for life? Oh, that's the health thing. Oh wow. Oh wow. Oh, I'm dying, man. I'm dying. I'm dying. Oh. Oh wow. Oh wow. Okay, so like I said, if you want to run with uh, all of your, if you if if you are limited to just the dual sense, and you've not downloaded the app that I keep talking about, then your only option would be. Oh wow. Okay, I have to heal. At least the healing is good because the healing, one healing will solve, uh, will heal you completely. I don't think they could see this person. I got them. I got the person. Yes, I got them. So all you gotta do is that you can still jump. Jumping is possible, and if you want this dude to kind of move quicker, you do need to press down on your uh, triangle. And what that does, it uh, puts away your weapons, and then it kind of moves a bit quicker. But this is as fast as it goes. Unfortunately, like I said, when I click down on, the, on my um, actual gamepad, it doesn't do much. It's a good thing I saw that dude. You see, as soon as I put the weapons away, no problem. Okay, I think that dude, he hasn't seen me. I don't know how many people are left. Uh, there's three of us. Oh, damn. Okay, where's that guy going? What? Where did he go? Oh, wow, he's up there. That's super quick. Now, I didn't see him. That, that's the thing. Come on. 
Come on, come on. Yeah, I've cracked him. I've cracked him. I've cracked this dude. Yes, I've cracked him. I cracked his shield. People just need to get to this dude. Yes, got him. Nicely. Nice. He's trying to hide though. Come on, let me get the kill. Yes, I got the kill. So just press downwards on uh, the the square thingy, square button. Oh wow! Look at all the abilities they got. Yes, we won. And I used the dual sense control. That's Fallout A4 on the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 5. And uh, it's sitting on a BS D3. That's a Bluetooth gamepad with glowing buttons. The laptop in the background is the MSI uh, Raider GE 67HX gaming laptop. Right, so we won. Right, that wasn't so bad. That's a good game. It was just a, a gameplay. I just wanted to test and see what the game would play like with the DualSense controller. But I did say I have an app. Uh, on my phone that actually allows uh, games to be added and game pads of different types Xbox DualSense even the um, the controllers the joy cons for uh, switch can be added uh, Onto Android and you can play games on it as well Right um, For me to use that app it does require me to enable some permissions on dev uh, on developer mode so I still need um, to go into developer mode and then obviously it's going to need some permissions to be done and what what that's actually meaning is that it needs you to do certain uh, to allow certain actions before the um, you know before the the controller itself can be um, can be added and the games will work properly let's look at the heroes um, a guy's got no, no screen steam. What's happening to this thing? There's a time when he, he jumps on the screen. Wondering if it's changed. How do I get to the next uh, character? Oh, it needs to download resources. Okay, you know like, you know like um, Call of Duty Mobile, how you, when you open the game, it needs you to download the skins and the maps. This is what it's saying. So it needs to download those resources. Like I told you, I don't normally play this game on Android. I just downloaded it because I wanted to see if it works with the DualSense controller. Uh, this already works on the iPhone with the backbone. And I've got certain videos showing this, but I've never played this on Samsung. So I just wanted to give it a go. So yes, it does work with the DualSense controller. So if you're curious, does this work with the DualSense controller? It does work. Are there any kind of um, are there any kind of uh, apps that allow you to add controllers and games? Uh, any controller you like to play any game you like, even PUBG Mobile with a controller. Yes, there are apps like that on uh, Play Store. But the the most popular app that I'm talking about costs ten dollars just for you to unlock the pro version because when you download the app itself. It's free to download, but you cannot use it unless you're using the pro version. Why? Because it allows you to add program, um, controllers of different kinds. You can add Xbox, PlayStation, uh, even Joy-Cons, you know, the ones for the, um, um, for the Switch controllers. Those Joy-Con controllers, you can take them off and use it. Right, uh, uh, I played, this is Fallout 84 guys, and next I will be playing is Warzone Mobile. Um, I wanted to do a bit of cloud, this is, uh, this is like cloud gaming, I'll just show you quickly. So this, this one is just connected to DualSense, and you'll see that the DualSense does get recognized straight away. And up there where the gamepad thing is, it does recognize that it's connected, see? So if I started uh, Fortnite here, it would definitely start and it will go into. So that's actual, that's actual color gaming. But I've done Fortnite enough today. I don't think it's necessary. So the next game I'll be playing will be Wars on Mobile. Like I said, I do want to see what the new maps on Call of Duty 3 look like. And the only way for me to f see that 
would be to actually start the game up on my laptop so as soon as i'm finished playing on uh this was on mobile the, i'm gonna play this for several hours even before i get to my laptop because i like the game and the game plays really well on my samsung so i don't have an issue towards on mobile uh even with the juicing score it works really well and with this game i just sit back and play the game so I, <laughs> i'm not stressed like i am with other games so what i'm saying is i want to see the new maps that are on call of duty because uh season four started recently and the only way for me to see those new maps will be on the actual game from steam and obviously that's why the laptop is there isn't it so yeah i'll be playing worlds on mobile after this